To resist integration, segregation academies cropped up across mid-20th century America. These private schools excluded African-American students, but otherwise opened their doors to the public. The court gave this tactic a failing grade in Runyon v. McCrary. The Gonzalez family received brochures in the mail for Fairfax Brewster's school and Bobby's school and saw an ad for Fairfax Brewster. But Fairfax Brewster rejected Colin Gonzalez's application because he was African American. Sandy McCrary searched for a nursery school for her son Michael and saw an ad for Bobby's school. Both families contacted Bobby's school and learned it only accepted white children. McCrary and Gonzalez sued Russell and Catherine Runyon the owners of Bobby's school, and argued Runyon discriminated against them. Gonzalez separately sued Fairfax Brewster on the same basis. The district court combined the cases and permitted an association of private schools with similar admissions policies to intervene as a defendant. The court found for the children and enjoined the schools from discriminating against African Americans. The Fourth Circuit affirmed. The Supreme Court granted cert.